I had somebody drop off a pile of VW four lug drums, 14 millimeter, four bolt pattern, so they're the later bolt pattern, um, four by 130. And he wants to get them drilled out for five by 130. So that's what we're going to do. Just in case you don't already know, the 5x130 bolt pattern won't fit in between these four lug holes. So you have to use one of them. So you'll use, in my case I'm going to use this one, and then I'm going to drill, 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 drill. And when you mount it, these three won't have anything in them but this one and the four that you add will have uh, lugs in them to hold the wheels on to do that I made myself a little fixture plate here it's got the four bolt holes for the existing lugs a centering hole just for reference and of course I labeled it so that when I see it later I'll know when the world this thing is and I also put some dimensions up here so that I'll know so I'll know where the other four holes go. It, it'll make sense once once we get into it. Um, so let's just get into it. So here it is fastened down with some uh, countersunk screws to help center it in each of those four holes. And I'm just using a four flute roughing carbide end mill here spiral drilling down through the through the material just getting a rough hole those uh, corn cob end mills are nice but they leave a, a bit of a rough edge not terrible but bad enough to follow it up with what I've got here it's just a regular four flute not the roughing kind, but just a standard one. It's also carbide. Just taking off, I think it's two thousandths I left. So we input one of the coordinates from the plate so that the machine will know where to go. And as you can see, I've got a, uh, I'm not sure what that thing's called. It's like a center for tapping. And I'm hand tapping these holes. It would be nice to be able to use a tapping head, but I don't have one for this machine yet. The Quick Switch 200 tooling must be made out of gold or something because everybody acts like it is when they're selling it. But anyway, it actually wasn't that bad doing the hand tapping, except that I had eight of them to do. But even though, even with that, it wasn't bad. So here's a here's a finished one here. Here you can see the new threads versus the old one, and I went ahead and chased the one of the original holes, the one we're going to use with the tap so that it'll be nice and clean and uh, they turned out pretty good so the guy that had them he, he's got two gears and two sets of phone dials uh, Porsche phone dials that he's gonna put on them so him and his kid can have matching wheels which is pretty cool uh, but he went ahead and took them home put them on and both cars and from what he says no shimmy no shake seems like everything's fine so well, that's it. Thanks for watching.